Yo ski broskies, this is Zach Cloud, and I'm playing some more Plants vs. Zombies with the No Sunflowers, No Sun Shrooms Challenge. And we've got a pool level, uh, as evidenced by this guy with the floaty. And we've got some football zombies, buckethead zombies, and newspaper zombies. So this is going to be tough. Let's, uh, let me try to remember. I'm still in, like, night mode in my mind. <laughs> Oh, forgot that almost. And these new guys, the squashes, these are good. Really good. Alright, let's get going. Oh, no sun plants? I know. I know. Oh, 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 oh. Not yet, not yet. Phew. Glad they let me put it back. Jumping the gun here. Yeah, I'm in my, like, plant everything really quick now mode from playing so many night levels. Um... There's actually some people who are allergic to sunlight um, in real life. Uh, I first heard about it in a fictional book, but it, it's a real condition where people, if they get out in the sun, then they break out severely and can die of anaphylactic shock. I was like, you know, that would suck so bad. Um, there was someone who lived down the road at uh, near my parents' house where I'm wondering if maybe someone who lived in there might have been allergic to the sun or otherwise otherwise photophobic because the, the house that they were in only had some windows upstairs. There were no windows downstairs at all. And what few windows... There was like one... Well, there was one window, but it was blacked out. And then they had, like, a side thing, side hallway covered thing that went out to the side of an RV. And the RV always had all the blinds down, all the curtains drawn. I don't know. It's a very rare condition, so if, if that is someone who's had it, then I, you know, that would be a very unlikely thing to see. That would suck so much, though. Because I love my sunshine. I love getting out and just laying out in the sun, sunning myself. I miss that now that it's winter. But, uh, oh, oh I, I should get this guy down here sooner. I haven't really dealt with these guys in the daytime before, or at least not that I can remember. So I'm not sure what range I should have everything. Oh boy. Uh, okay, I popped off the arm. Phew, uh, that was close. Okay, I can get mini games. Sweet. Up, oh, up. Oh. Get this guy as soon as possible. He looks kind of fast to me. Oh boy, I really need to pay more attention. Dum, dum. I'm dumb, dumb, dumb for not paying enough attention soon enough. Oh no. I don't know here. I'm just gonna have to hold him off. I can eventually buy, uh, when, once Dave opens his shop, I don't think he has, but uh, I can eventually buy some pool cleaners, which will go across the whole pool instead of just falling in like these lawnmowers do. Uh, I'm surprised I remembered to call them pool cleaners, because I, I often find myself calling them something else completely different. Uh, like, just things that make no sense. Get a little more sun before I start going for this guy. Actually, I don't think it'll make too much difference. Well, it might, because this is right before flag. So, yep. Just work on him slowly. Zombie! Zombie, zombie. <laughs> a 
my brother hates that song. I like it. I I mostly like this uh, cover version by uh, Ah, oh, shoot, I forget the name of the group who covers it. Miser, I think? Is it either M-I-S-E-R or M-I-Z-E-R? But, uh, yeah, I like their version. It's cool. There's another good, uh, zombie song that I like called The Zombie Song by, uh, Stephanie Maybe. Guys, here because this lane is getting kind of crowded. Um, but it's a love story between a zombie and a human. Uh, if I were a zombie, I'd never eat your brain. I'd just want your heart. Yeah, I'd want your heart. I just want your heart. Oh, <laughs> it's so silly. It's a great little silly Halloween song. guy down here. Let him eat you up. I'm not gonna put up a wall yet. I'm gonna wait and see. Oh boy. Oh boy, this is bad. Very, very bad. I don't know what I'm gonna do here. I should have put a wall, like, out here or something so I could put a, a snow pea there or something, but I wasn't thinking about the future enough. I need to think more about, about the future. Oh man, and another one! The water is just getting assaulted here. Okay, um... Hmm. I might have to end up using the squashes on these guys. At least one of them. Uh, let's see. Okay, I might use Chomper on one, Squash on the other. Uh, then again, his bucket is about to come off. Okay, I'm gonna probably try replacing the walnut real quick, yeah. Although this guy's gonna be kind of a problem too, but at least we've bought some time. Ooh! Getting really, really intense here. I don't have a lot of sun either to deal with it. It keeps not coming. Come on, sunshine, come on! I used to think that the day would never come, that my life would depend on the morning sun. So many fitting songs out there. I think that one was from the 80s or early 90s. I forget who sang it. Come on, Walnut. Hold up. You can do it. Ah! Dang it. Whew. Just in time. I can't keep getting by the skin of my teeth like this, though. Gotta do something else. And I've, I've gotten behind because I've had to replace the walnut so many times, so I don't have as much sun now as I could have if I would have been saving it up more or spending it on snow peas. Uh, this lane's gonna get in trouble now. Oh boy. Uh, well, I can almost afford a chomper. Okay, I might wait. Well, no, it's been too long, so I'm gonna go in with a chopper. That was close. Chomp. Whoo, gosh, 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 gosh. Okay, this is the final wave. So if they get through now, then it's okay, but I'd rather they not, as usual. If I can save as many lanes as I can, then I will. I either have to put a wall in front of this chomper, or put a chomper here, but I don't think I can afford one fast enough. Let's see if that comes up fast enough. It probably won't. 
But this is just, you know, saving face here at this point. Yeah, this top lane is a goner. Those football players are way too tough. Okay, this one worked. Uh, this one should be able to make it. And this one should, maybe, maybe. Ooh. Wow, not too bad, not too bad. Only lost one. And now we got the three-peater. Shoots peas in three lanes. Those are neat as heck, but once again, I don't think we'll be able to afford them because, uh, and really, they're just a space saver. Hey, you want to buy an extra seed slot? It'll cost you $5,000. How does that sound? Um, yeah, uh, nah. Bummer, dude. He might keep bothering me about it until I do it, though, so I might eventually just do it. Uh-oh. Snorkel zombies. They go down under the water so your pea shooters can't shoot them. Uh, oh boy. Okay. Gonna have to have walls ready to stop them in the middle of the water and or squash them whenever I can. Just waiting around now. Um... Uh, I can talk about what used to be my favorite TV station, Animal Planet. It's like, there's so many stations about humans on TV that it's nice to have one where it's not about humans, it's just about animals and their own lives and their own dramas and complications, but also their simplicity and, and they're just doing what they do. And it was awesome back when they had really good programs like uh, Backyard Habitat where it's basically a design show where they help you decorate your yard but it's also for the purpose of creating habitat for animals. And at the end they show animals actually using those habitats. Uh, which was really nice. Then they had like some sunrise show where they would just show sunrises around the world and show animals playing around on the beach or in the woods and the sun rising in the background. It was really, really relaxing and nice. Uh, they had lots of like Meerkat Manor, Orangutan Island, all kinds of good shows where they just show animals doing what they do. Uh, Planet's Funniest Animals, great, great show. Um, but uh, nowadays though, they completely changed the station and their tagline is surprisingly human. And that is how the station is now. It's surprisingly for the name about humans. They have like shows like freaking search for Bigfoot. Like, come on. He's not. I mean, even if he is real, uh, you know that they're not going to find it in that show. Uh, that would be in the news before it would be in that show. So it's just a bunch of rednecks running around in the woods, getting excited over shadows and stuff. I mean, sure, it might exist. I, I believe that it might. And this is bad, meanwhile. Phew, that was close. But, uh... But it's like, come on. That, that's not a show for Animal Planet. Put that on freaking TLC or something. But, uh, and then they have Tanked, which is vaguely about animals in that it's about a bunch of young guys who make, uh, fish tanks. Uh, but yeah, it's barely about the fish, it's mostly about them and their drama and, and their daily lives, and it's a reality show, basically. And then there's this Alaskan cop show, I forget what it's called, but, uh... It's just about a bunch of 
cops in Alaska who patrol roads and write tickets and talk to people and arrest people and and it's not even about animals and treehouse masters freaking building tree houses sure they're beautiful they're awesome tree houses I'll give them that but put that on TLC or HGTV or something it has nothing to do with animals other than animals sometimes live in trees I mean the, the, the parallels that they're trying to draw to attach it to their station are feeble at best. Um, and so, like, the only animal shows that they now have are either animals as abuse victims, you know, like animal cops and stuff, which they've always had before, uh, and animals victimizing humans. You know, shows where animals who rarely attack people, but those rare events are caught on tape, and it makes the animals look bad or things about like parasites in humans and stuff like that it's like come on why are they doing that they're they're making animals look worse if anything oh, oh, that guy uh, I'll put it about here I guess some reinforcement on this lane because that cone head was in front of the regular guy. Ah, oh no, we got another one now. This will make him come up, but I don't know if this will be ready in time. Come on, Walnut, come on. I don't know. I don't want to waste 25 sun. Hey, dang it. Blah. Best I could do. I thought I heard a coin. Oh well, must have been the music. But um, yeah, the at least there's a new channel out now called Nat Geo Wild or National Geographic Wild, and it uh, is actually about animals. It's like, oh my gosh, when they show people, they're actually people who help animals or take care of animals, like uh, the Yukon vet, uh, and all the different animals that she treats and stuff. So it's like, okay, that's how you do it. That's the new animal planet. So if you, you know, used to be a fan of animal... Well, no! No, 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 that's not what I meant to do. Ah, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. But yeah, if you miss Animal Planet, then look for Nat Geo Wild. See if you get it or not. It's an extra channel, so it might cost extra or something, but uh, I'd say probably worth it if you'd rather watch animals than people on TV. Phew. I can't believe I misclicked. That was no, oh, that sucked. <laughs> oh boy. We're coming up on the final wave though, so as long as we hold everything until that point, then we should be okay. Oh, there's still another pretty big set though here. I think we'll be okay though. This walnut holds. I can afford another one at least. But I'm thinking I should put some extra things in the water, something to reinforce it, because the water's probably going to be bad on the final lane. And then again, it might be okay. Uh, wait, these lanes are both possibly in trouble. Decide. Okay. Made my decision. Just went for double firepower here. And these guys are still here for the final wave. I might have to do something else here. Then again, the lawnmowers will save the day. 
but I don't like depending on the lawnmowers. Oh my gosh, look at this crowded pool. That is a pool party, jeez. I don't know, I don't, how am I, eh. Yeah, I'm gonna have to just, then again, I might not even be able to depend on this because they're all strung out. Oh no, 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 no. Oh boy. Okay, blocked off some of them. Okay, this one is gonna hit that. Uh, oh dear. Okay, and now I'm gonna have to use you. Aw, oh, this isn't gonna come back in time. Oh no. Oh no, I think we're gonna lose this one, everyone. No! We lost! I lost! Oh no!